Hey, I want to thank God openly right up front. I'm at the Amore House Homecoming. This is for the calendar year 2024. Shout out to Caleb Grant, senior middle linebacker. Um, today is a powerful day. I want to thank God again for blessing me with the honors yesterday of being in an article and doing an article of me at uh, my job building robots. That was one of the last stages, which I never thought about, never dreamed about getting an honor at my job. But that's just showing me that God, once again, is going above and beyond, or at least pinching off a little bit to show how mighty God is. So I'm so thankful for that. Thank you, God, for the championship ring, for coaching. Thank you for the championship for winning as a player. Thank you for allowing me to have extracurricular and uh, coach basketball now, assistant coach, to help out with the game. I totally appreciate it. I thank you for the Ed Reed interview that I did right here or out here on the field. Um, thank you for the Modex Award that we did win as champions in the robot game. So a lot of great things have been happening for me, and I believe it will continue. My faith and my positivity is getting bigger, getting stronger, getting more and more into the spirit of God as it feels like the world is getting further and further away. I'm thankful to God, no matter what anybody says. God bless all these people here, these players, the teams. Uh, Morehouse is playing against Fort Valley State today. So I thank God for being able to get here. I had to finagle this particular time to get in. They wouldn't just let me naturally come through. So as usual, you know, I have to depend on my spirit, but shout out to brother Tim coaching. He got me in. So I'm thankful for everything that I'm a part of, man. Uh, I'm humble. They got the flag going up there. Showing. That says, uh, don't vote for Trump, vote for Kamala. Harris, the political world is a different arena. And that's another conversation. But I just suggest that I continue to enjoy the breeze as God allows the sun to shine, not only in my life, but in the world over. So as long as it's happened like this, Lord, thank you for me getting diagnosed. Uh, they said I was pre-diabetic. Thank you for allowing my A1C to be a 5.9 when it says it's supposed to be a 5.6. Thank you for nothing that's inside of my body that's an infection, even though I was accused of some things. Thank you for the people that appreciate me. And thank you for the people that are that don't appreciate me. So I appreciate you, God, for what you're doing. Thank you for allowing me to be a vessel and a power, as best that I know how, to be a help to other people. Seeing daughter, son, Jesus, name God, I always pray. Amen.